It's been six months since I got my rezzo cut and let me tell you about this journey. Hi, hi! It's been about six months since I had the rezzo cut experience right here for the first time and when I really went in to get my hair cut, my biggest concerns was I kept getting haircuts that weren't really working with my curls. Like, it would look good the day it was cut because that's where my hair length was. But then as my hair grew out, you know, it would just change and it just wouldn't keep its shape. So for instance, with my hair, the curls on the bottom half underneath are a bit straighter than the curls on top. So as my hair would get longer, that would just, it would really look like I'd have some bad extensions and no layering in, which is not true. My hair is good. <laughs> but going into the Rezo Cut experience, I was just thinking, they say that when you get this cut, that they really take in your curl pattern on all parts of your head and really it's meant to keep its shape both when it's curly and when it's straight so that way everything still looks even everything still looks well proportioned and when i got the haircut i loved it i mean look look at that like i looked my hair looked good it was round it was fluffy it was just beautiful and at the salon they actually went over like hey this is what your hair needs my hair needed a lot more moisture for example and and also tell me hey like which type of products would work best in your hair whether it's creams or whether it's gels so over the past couple months i've really been taking time out just to kind of take what they told me and work it into my hair care routine and really this is where I'm at right now. And one thing I really really love about this like post six month rezzo cut experience is that my hair for the most part has still kept its shape. Like it's still rounded which is what I really wanted. I do notice that the top part is getting a little flat, but that's because, you know, that's where my hair is going out from. I'm fully aware that I'm going to need trims. I would also say that my hair is a lot healthier. Now, when I first went to the Red Zone Cut Experience, like I mentioned, I needed a lot more moisture in my hair and that was something that was told to me as well as something I could see myself and really just learning what products work for me, what products I should have, and where I need to focus on in the whole protein moisture balance just to have balanced curls. And my hair, I don't know if you can see, it looks a lot healthier. I'm also just gonna try to show the shape of it for a bit. Real nice. <laughs> um, but yeah, my hair, honestly, it feels a lot healthier. I still have a long way to go in regards to getting my hair to that completely balanced state. I'm still figuring things out, but I'm definitely a lot further along than I was before. And even when it comes to like styling my hair, I've gotten a lot better with it. And on top of that, you know, everything just, it looks good, I feel good, and it's keeping in shape. The only thing I would say is when I did get it cut, I had a bang, and it actually grew really, really fast, so I cut it myself. I might do a video on how I cut it in the future, but other than that, like, this is all growth. This is all really just no touch-ups, no nothing. This is six months after that one cut and I just I don't know what to say like I'm so happy that it's kept its shape I'm so happy that there's no difference in layers and length they like really took my hair into consideration how my curls are forming where they're forming so for instance like I said the bottom half of my hair the curls are much straighter than it is on the top half but also on top of that I don't know if you could kind of tell but this side one of my sides 
<laughs> is a bit flatter than the other side. So one side has more volume, the other side doesn't. I'm not 100% sure if that's how my hair naturally is or if it comes from years of parting my hair and putting everything to one side, which could have affected it now that I think about it. Mm -hmm. But yeah, <laughs> now one thing I am concerned about is how my hair is going to look six months from now. So about a year after that Rezo cut experience just to see if it truly truly does keep its shape. But also one thing I noticed with the Rezo cut, I saw a lot of girls with that voluminous like cute little <laughs> circle shape and everybody's hair was short and then with the girls whose hair was longer it wasn't as rounded um but also that's because of the length so i am curious to see like how my hair is going to look when it's much longer and that's i definitely think for the next six months i'm going to try to just keep my hair as healthy as possible and see how this rezo cut grows out i think the only thing i might cut or even do a trim is just the bang but for the most part, I really just want to see how it grows. You know, is this a haircut that is there for the long term? Or is it like one of those cuts where it's like the shape is great when you first cut it, but after some time, it just doesn't work with you. But yeah, overall, going in to get my rezo cut, having my hair cut so much shorter, and then with curls and the shrinkage, and then also my different curl patterns throughout my head, it was very, very, <laughs> I had a lot of anxiety. I was definitely, definitely happy with my initial cut, once again here, um, but I was concerned about how it would look when it grows because that's where I've had my issues with. But now that it's been six months since I got that Rezo cut, my shape is still here, my hair is a lot healthier, my curls, especially when I take care of them properly, are flawless. The volume, the lift, it's still there. There's still some parts of my hair that I do need to work on, but it's not as bad as it used to be and I'm going in the right direction. So I do look forward to seeing where my hair is a year from when I got my Rezo cut. So six months from now, but yeah, this is my Rezo cut experience. This is six months after I first got the cut. This is where my hair is now. It's just beautiful. I obviously did not part my hair properly but <laughs> I feel like it's healthier I feel that when it's much longer it's still going to keep its shape which I hope but it's definitely a hair cut that I'm happy with six months later I'm still happy with the same cut that I got at my first ever Rezo cut experience but what can I say like I really love my haircut it's six months later and it's still good so yeah let me know about your Rezo cut experience if you're thinking about getting a Rezo cut or any other curly haircut that you have gotten or looked at I really just want to hear about your experience what you're thinking and how it's come about like six or a couple months later how has your hair changed so let me know in the comments Thank you and bye. Oh, my hair looks so good. <laughs>